Okay, now we have talked about a crime in financial world, we have talked about a crime in the social world, we have talked about a crime in online world. Let us talk about the crime that happen against children, cyber bullying, cyber stalking that may be against ladies and uh, children and both everyone that can happen. That can also be various other types of crime where you are being threatened and you are being chased and you are being bullied and basically what not you can be done. How does it happen? Maybe through a person who has been making you as a friend in the social media and after that point of time they can leverage you and try to use you as uh, for doing something wrong. It, it can happen when you are playing a game as a child then somebody lures you, drives you towards to do something which is not great or it may happen when somebody online is giving you a lot of abuses, a lot of pressures, a lot of mental anxiety and chasing you again and again and again bombarding using the words and languages and images and videos which are not good for you to see. What to do at that point of time? How should we handle that up? Understand for that matter number one that when you are going online, uh, you are there for a specific purpose. Why you are there? One that you want to make sure that you are connecting with the world. The love and connection that you receive in the online one kicks out a dopamine which is quite refreshing, quite satisfying and quite uh, energetic as well most of the time. Also you want to make sure that you are solving a lot of problems for the people. You have an impact that you are making and for that impact you are there to go towards to the online and help others in a significant manner. So those point of time you need to be sure that uh, you are here that uh, you will be using those services and making sure that if somebody cyber bullying happens, cyber crime happens against you, you are careful of noting, notifying others in either of these three platforms. So not only your children, your loved ones are also being kept track of and also being notified for. Three things need to be informed. Number one, that keep check of the persons who are there, they can report to others. Number two, if something happens against your images, your personality, your persona, uh, there is someone always who is helping you, who is always taking care of you. And number three, when somebody is being the victim of that, there is always a possibility to tell the government, give them the protection, give them the love and respect and the level of freedom that they can express themselves. They are not the person who are culprit the culprit is someone else, don't try to punish them because they try to do something which was not to your, uh, to your right and to your uh, greatness. So understand that, that's why the steps are the same. Thank you very much.